Hi everybody, this is Scott Blue here, I'm filming another awesome tech video. Today we're going to be showcasing my Dell Venue 8 tablet with Steam in-home streaming and wirelessly linked and modified drivers for PS4 wireless controller, right here. Uh, and how we can pair, wire, Bluetooth pair the controller to my, new, my uh, Dell Venue 8 Pro tablet running Windows 8.1 and then load up Steam's in-home streaming and it just and how it works and it seems to be working very well as you can see here we have full control uh... it's simulating an xbox 360 controller through x input driver mod um, i'll show i'll put a link in the description where you can get the drivers that allow this to happen and we're running over wi-fi obviously because there's no wired connection on the dell venue 8 tablet and we're just having a good time streaming this is awesome, really awesome uh, I've been very impressed with Steam and home streaming so far since they've updated it. Oh man, it's starting to get nighttime in Skyrim. <laughs> I don't think anyone is going to come jump at me. Um, so it's been we've, I've been having lots of fun, a lot of experimentation um, with it. And at first, it was hard. It took a lot of modifying my network wireless. I found that my network on a 5G network, uh, 5 gigahertz radio signal band is much more stable than the, my 2.4 gigahertz band and so I've been messing around with that getting that working uh, did a little bit of research and to for like con uh, controls because it was a at first it was like well it's a pain in the butt trying to hook up an OTG cable to your tablet because it's up on the side on the Dell Venue 8 Pro and so it's kind of hard to get the tablet orientated and, and to control a game and you don't really want to hook up a keyboard and mouse so I was trying to think well is there a way I can do it wirelessly so I did some research and I found this uh, awesome article uh, that was put out in February by PCMag.com. And in that, mag in that article, they were talking about this new driver that was released to emulate an Xbox 360 controller with a PS4 controller, which is here, right here. Woohoo! See, it's controlling the game wirelessly. So this is paired to the tablet, and the tablet is running the custom driver. Because, again, it's awesome that the Dell Venue 8 is a full Windows 8 tablet. Uh, it's a pretty beefy tablet. Uh, I think the Dell that's this it's running on Bait Trail, so it's the Z3740. I'll have to look that up. I'll put the exact specifications in there. It's got two gigs of DDR3, um, low power consumption RAM. I've got a 64 gigabyte expansion card because it does have an SD card in there. So I've got a 64 gig card in there, and that's where my Steam is installed on, and you know other things. Uh, so I have the Steam installed, and we're doing in-home streaming, and it seems to be the tablet seems to have a powerful enough processor. Um, battery life, uh, you know, it, it doesn't seem to be too bad on the battery. It's no more than streaming video because basically that's what we're doing here is just streaming back video and sending some in input control data back through the tablet, through the network. Um, like I said, Steam and home streaming is very sensitive to network traffic, so I found that on my uh, 5 gigahertz network that it was much more stable and a lot less laggy because I have a lot less devices that connect up to the 5 gigahertz network, so my um, computer and my tablet are the only one that run right now currently on the 5 gigahertz network. So it's it's actually gotten very good with updates. I'm very impressed with it, and I think it has a lot of usability. Like if you want to be hanging out with somebody in another room, not on your desktop, but you want to do like off-screen gaming, you know. And this doesn't only work with Steam games. I've gotten Steam and home streaming, and like in my other videos, I figured out how to make it work with like PS2 emulator. So you want to play a PS2 game on your computer, and you want to stream it to your tablet because it's got a higher pixel density. You know, PPI. Like this one is 720. And every I see it, it looks amazing with uh, PS2 games. Uh, so it, it's really awesome. I was been really happy with the success. I just was making this video to share it with all of you out there and to show you this cool stuff so I'll put all the links in the description for uh, the uh, controller and how to make that work and the article from PC Mag World so that if you have a Dell Venue 8 or similar spec to Windows tablet that you can try this out uh, thanks for watching uh, hopefully you like this video and if you want to leave a comment or a like that would be great take it easy bye